How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And today I'm going to show you guys some of the best IP changers you could use in the market today. Of course, if you're changing your IP, uh, the best way to do so is use a VPN. That way you'll secure your data as well as access geo-restricted content with that IP. Uh, otherwise, if you change your IP, let's say using a proxy, you're not going to be able to access geo-restricted content because most, let's say, streaming services will be able to detect they're using a proxy and will block you. So, of course, what we're using here is ExpressVPN, NordVPN, and Surfshark. So, if you're interested in any of those, you'll find links to special deals and discounts in the description down below, as well as full-on reviews if you'd like to know the ins and outs of these VPNs. So, okay, I have whatismyipchanger.com here. And, of course, it's showing that I'm in New York because uh, I'm connected to ExpressVPN's New York server. Now, before we, before let's say you turn on your VPN, I would definitely recommend using the uh, protocols here, the best performing protocols. That'll be Lightweight UDP with ExpressVPN. It'll be Nord Links with NordVPN. So we're going to switch to Nord Links here. And that'll be with, that'll be WireGuard, excuse me, with um, Surfshark. So, of course, if you're looking for uh, unblocking, let's say, HBO Max, you're going to have to look for an American server. And it really is as simple as just going to locations, looking for the appropriate server, and you're good to go. So now it's demonstrated already here with ExpressVPN. So let me just demonstrate it again with NordVPN. It's really as simple as that. So let's say I'm looking to unblock the French. Where's the, there it is. Let's say I'm looking to unblock a French library. So I'm going to connect to France real quick here. And with Nordlinks, it should be almost instant. Yeah, we already, we're already connected. And uh, yeah, Nordlinks is a true WireGuard protocol. Super quick. If you're looking for speed, definitely go with NordVPN. But if you're looking for consistency and top security, then ExpressVPN will be uh, the way to go. And of course, if you're looking to unblock the most amount of streaming services as well, ExpressVPN will be the way to go by virtue of having uh, more uh, regions covered, up to 94 countries with ExpressVPN, uh, 60 countries with NordVPN, and 65 countries with Surfshark. Uh, so yeah, of course, as you can tell here, the IP did change naturally, and we are in France, Paris. And we're going to disconnect again. And I'd like to just showcase how you can find a server in Surfshark since we already did it with the other two. So let's just say for this uh, part here, we're just going to do Germany. Um, then I'm going to refresh again. Again, if you're looking for the cheapest uh, or VPN, if you're looking for something that's super budget friendly, and as you can tell, by the way, the IP changed and the country will change as well. Uh, Surfshark <clears throat> will be the way to go. Uh, it's a great VPN. It's just a VPN that gets the job done with the least cost possible. Uh, super effective. And of course, it'll let you unblock, uh, not unblock, it'll let you um, secure an unlimited amount of devices with just one connection, which is one of its uh, biggest selling points, really. Whereas ExpressVPN will allow you to secure five and Nord six devices per subscription. Surfshark will allow you to do that with an unlimited amount of devices with just one subscription. Now, of course, if you want to be able to unblock an unlimited amount of, um, uh, or not on. Now, of course, if you want to unblock an unlimited amount of devices with ExpressVPN and NordVPN, you're going to have to connect or install uh, these VPNs on a router. Only then you'll be able to secure every single device that's connected to that router. So that's the way to do it. But Surfshark just allows you to do so uh, without a router. Now, again, just to conclude, if you're looking for the top security and anonymity, ExpressVPN is the best VPN when it comes to security with a very solid no-lock policy and privacy policy, uh, as well as the highest consistency rate of unblocking streaming services. It'll be able to unblock some of the most obscure streaming services all the way to the most popular ones. So yeah, super solid VPN overall and very easy to use. And now if you're looking for a VPN that gives you a few more features and one more device to secure per subscription, you get features like specialty servers, custom DNS, and an app kill switch uh, with the super speedy NordLynx protocol. Definitely go with NordVPN. But if you're looking for the uh, very budget-friendly uh, VPN that just gets the job done 
without really having you shell out a whole bunch of cash for it. Uh, and it'll also be able to unblock a whole bunch of streaming services and secure an unlimited amount of devices. For reference, by the way, ExpressVPN is able to unblock over 18 Netflix libraries. That'll be 10 with Norton, 15 with Surfshark. So hopefully that gives you an idea of um, the capabilities of unblocking streaming services for each VPN. So that'll be it for this video. Again, if you guys are interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find links to special deals and discounts in the description down below, as well as full on reviews if you'd like to know the ins and outs of these VPNs, including advantages and disadvantages. Besides that, thank you guys very much for watching and have a wonderful day.